clear waters, deserted islands and a sinking canoe, we're paddling around Sharp Island right here on Drone and Phone. Well, welcome to our second episode of our kayak adventures. George, what are we doing today? So today we're here now in Shah Harbour, and then later on we're going to paddle over to Sharp Island and then come back. We're going right over there to Sharp Island and we're renting our boats. Remember, for this series, we're only going to places where you can rent kayaks from this place right here. Right, let's get going. Let's go. Summer is here and as the temperature starts to soar, we are seeking relief in the cool waters that surround Hong Kong. In this series, we pick five of the best places to rent and take out a kayak as we swap our walking boots for paddles and life jackets. In this episode, we start at Shaha Beach, where we pick up a rental kayak and head off towards Sharp Island. Take time to choose your kayak from a rental shop as they can differ according to your size and the conditions. Once that was sorted, we grabbed our paddles and headed out. kilometers come across from Saikon over there we get out onto Soundbank spend some time I'm gonna go for a swim see if I can see some fish in here but you can see behind us we have Sharp Island the Junk Peak over there and of course the great Maan Shan right over there it's a beautiful day perfect day for exploring Saikon After carrying our kayak over the sandbank, I see the sea is much calmer in the sheltered bay on the other side, a perfect place to practice some kayak skills. I'm going to send him off. This is a relatively calm spot here and I'm going to spend, send George off to see if he can sit at the back and keep it as straight as possible. So it'll be a bit back heavy, but I want you just to go out to here and paddle around and come back and see how straight you can get it. Challenge accepted. Let's go. Getting the hang of kayaking on the sea can be quite a challenge as the waves will knock you off course. But practice makes perfect and with a little training I was confident enough to put George at the back of the boat. While the person at the front provides the power, the helmsman must keep the kayak on course. good rest, we take off back around the island to the area best known for what lies beneath the sea. So I've heard there's some pretty good coral around here and the great thing about being on these open deck boats is it's quite easy to jump off and on. After a 15 minute swim, it's time to jump back aboard and head back to Shaha Beach. We take a detour around Cham Tao Chow as the waves pick up with more pleasure boats in the bay. This is the perfect way to enjoy a hot summer Hong Kong day. Well, that's the end of this episode. We've done about 12 kilometers in the end. How is it for you, George? I think I'm getting better and better because I was carrying DJ the whole time. I did most of the battling now. If you like this episode, please like and subscribe wherever you see this. We're going to be bringing you more kayak adventures in the next few weeks. For now, my name's DJ. I'm George. This is Drone and Phone.